Meg goes mad. Lip reader broke silence unveiled all shocking truth behind Has, William's secret talk. Exactly a year ago today, Prince Harry and Prince William were seen next to each other as they unveiled a statue of their mother Princess Diana, and a lip reader revealed what they said to each other. Last year, on what would have been her 60th, the Rowing brothers put their ongoing rift aside to come together to unveil a statue of their mother in the grounds of Kensington Palace, honoring her life and legacy. It was the first time they were reunited after Harry accused his brother of being trapped in his bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey and Meghan accused the Duchess of Cambridge of making her cry. It was their last joint engagement, despite Harry and Meghan's recent trip to the UK for the Queen's Platinum Jubilee. They were seen chatting during the event, which brought together everyone who has been involved in designing and creating the statue, and lip reader Jeremy Freeman picked up a brief but intriguing conversation between the two princes. As the pair waited at the steps by the Diana statue, a member of the staff gave quick instructions to the royals on how to unveil the statue. Freeman claims the man said, as you pull it, it'll slide over and drop, okay. He then adds that Harry put up his arms before turning to William and saying, we will be okay. William then looked left and right, adjusting the space and warned Harry, I didn't want anything to go wrong. It's important we unveil it right. But as William pointed out how he thought the cloth should be pulled, Harry said, let's just yank it. There has been much made of the rift between the two brothers with their frosty relationship reportedly sparked by William's concerns over Harry's fast developing relationship with Meghan ahead of their royal wedding in 2018. The tense row quickly boiled over, with Harry claiming his brother was trapped within the royal system during a bombshell interview with Oprah Winfrey after quitting as a senior royal. The brothers were not pictured together during the Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations, despite them both attending Trooping the Colour and a service at St. Paul's Cathedral. And according to royal expert and author Ingrid Seward, editor-in-chief of Majesty magazine, their relationship between the brothers is still at a very low ebb. She told the Mirror, despite appearing to do so, the two boys never got along particularly well. They sat together for TV interviews on their joint causes joshing with each other but they were never very good friends. In other news, Prince William and Kate Middleton's office has announced an exciting sporting bout taking place later this week. The Duke of Cambridge is set to return to the pitch as a polo player for a charity match. Kate Subby will take part in the Outsourcing Incorporated Royal Charity Polo Cup 2022 at Guards Polo Club on July 6. William's return as a polo player comes weeks after his brother Harry made his official debut as a member of the Los Padres team. The team, led by professional polo player, model and close friend of Harry Nacho Figueras, is based at the Santa Barbara Polo and Racquet Club, close to where the Duke and Duchess of Sussex now live. Kate Middleton may also appear to support William during his match. The Cambridges are all set to upstage the Sussexes with their appearance. William and Harry came head-to-head -head during a polo match for the last time in July 2019, when they led opposing teams while their wives and children looked on from the sidelines. Prince Charles' elder son William, with this match, will raise funds for a number of charities and associations close to his and Kate's heart.